In this video, I'm going to show you how to easily free up space on Google Drive. So let's get started. So the first thing that you have to do is just open Chrome and then you'll have to go to Google One because over here you can see a breakdown of where exactly all your memory is being used. So first you'll just have to type one.google.com slash storage. So just search for this. After that, make sure that you've signed in with the correct account. So you'll find that on the top right of the screen. Then over here, you can see a breakdown of where the storage is being used. As you can see, out of 9.5 GB, a large part is being used in Google Photos, then in Google Drive, and then a smaller part in Gmail. Now Google has made it extremely simple to free up space, and I'll show you exactly how to do it. First, you'll just have to scroll down, and over here you'll find an option, get your space back. So just click on free up account storage. Now it's taken us to a new page and here we get a detailed breakdown of where exactly the storage is being used. So if I scroll down, here you can see that it's showing all of the large items and I can free up up to 5 GB of space by going through all of the emails which have large attachments. On Google Drive, all of the large files and in Google Photos, photos which are large or even videos. So earlier, you'd have to go individually to mail, drive and photos, but now Google has made it extremely simple to delete the large files. So first, I'll just start from the top. So over here, under discarded items, you'll have deleted emails, spam emails or deleted files. So this is basically the trash of mail and Google Drive. And if you have items in the trash, you can delete them straight from here. After that, scroll down, and over here, you'll have the large files as I mentioned before. So now I'll just click on review and free up over here to delete the large files. Now it's extremely simple to go through all of these emails. The size of the attachments are given over here. And if you want to delete emails, then what you can do is just click on these boxes over here and then click on the trash icon on the top right. And then it's deleted. Now I've gone back and I'll show you Google Drive. It's similar, over here you'll get all of the files which are extremely large. As you can see, this file is 590 MB. So if I want to delete it, I can just click on it and click on move to trash. Just click on I understand and now delete it. And now it's gone. So the same way, you can go through all of the large files in Google Drive and delete them. After that, in Google Photos, just click on review and free up again. And the same way, over here you can select all of the files that you want to delete. Then you'll have to scroll up and again click on the trash icon on the top right. After this, there's a section of all other items. So in my case, I have 220 MB of unsupported videos. So what I can do is just click on review and free up, select all items and delete them. And now freed up 220 MB. So this is basically how it works. The storage manager makes it extremely simple to delete large files. And honestly, you can easily delete 3 to 5 GB just by going through this. So I hope this video helped you. And if it did, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Goodbye.